Hello and welcome back to Persona 3 Reload. It's about time for summer vacation, but before we do that, we have some places to go. We need to go through here, and then we need to go to this room right here. Why? Well, it's going to complete a mission. It's the PA room. I can hear bizarre music playing inside. What the heck is this song? Gecko Can Boogie? Why does the school have music like this? Must be a teacher's theme song or something that plays when they enter the classroom. No way, man, that's crazy. Should I try entering the room? Yes. Yes, I should. Sorry, you have to have permission to be in. Huh? This song? I have no idea what it's for, but it says Gecko Can Boogie on it. What? You want it? Are you serious? Sure, you can have it. We don't have any use for it anyway. Here. Now get out of here before you get me in trouble. I obtained the Gecko Can Boogie. That is the item we need for Elizabeth. I knew it was in a classroom, however, I just couldn't remember where. But now, I know. Cool. Right, uh, in terms of the next thing to do, we're going to leave here. We're going to go all the way to Polonia, which is next door. And then, we're going to run all the way over here, and we're going to speak to Elizabeth. Hello. Marvelous. Thank you for the Twilight I'm Fragments. And now I have a request for you. Are you accepting a request? Let's there hear the results. What is this circular disc? Gecko Can Boogie is written on one surface. Th this is there music stored inside of it? Then this sheet of paper must be the lyrics. Everyone was haiku writing. Those kids were as fast as lightning. Very well then. Hmm. I can't imagine what it sounds like from the words alone. I'll have to listen to it later. Alright, so a Kung Fu fighting uh, reference. Weird. But we got female uniforms S, which now means we have the summer uniforms for Tartarus. Cool. Uh, which means we have Tartarus, Tartarus, in progress, Tartarus, 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 Tartarus. So, we have a lot to do in Tartarus. Cool. Very right. Well. Now, I also uh, want to have a quick look at our calendar here. So... The 6th is when we are going to do the operation. So we're looking at like the 4th for going and doing um, Tartarus. Now, the thing is, we are not at school during this time, from my understanding, because we're not at school until uh, the welcoming ceremony on the 1st. So, um, yeah, we're not really uh, needing to leave gaps to go and uh, see the nurse. So we could go on the 5th, I suppose, but the 4th is probably safer. And we're actually going to skip there pretty much from the 27th, because uh, we're t track team pa practice for the rest of it, so. Okay, cool. Uh, let's just have a quick look at the bulletin board. We have no new people? Really? Do you have to go into Tartarus to get it to trigger? Huh. I don't know. That's weird that there are no new people on that list. You know what we should do? We should go into Tartarus on the 3rd. That way, if we um, if it, it spawns people in Tartarus, we can go on the 4th or the 5th. That's what we should do. Okay. I heard there's some scary shenanigans going on over those intertubes these days. How about that? I'm pr pretty in the know for an old guy, huh? Yeah, the shenanigans on the intertubes, definitely. Hello. Hey, I saw that guy tossing the ball in the arcade again. I walked up to him so I could ask what the ball was, but he just glared at me over his sunglasses. Then he walked out of the arcade without another word. Man, he's scarier than I thought. Okay. Cool. Um, let's leave. Then, we want to go to Naganaki Shrine. We want to go to the shrine so that we can then go over to here, and then we can get another thing for going into Tartarus. So we'll pray. Yep, yep. Give me a growth one. Cool. Literally the only card I want. That's fine. Okay. Then we want to leave here and we want to go to Gecko Can High School so we can get up with Chihiro. Is this our final one of Chihiro? I think it is actually, right? Uh, let's have a look. Is that our final social link with her? It is. Ooh, cool. Hello. Oh, it's Zaplasan. Exams are finally over. Um, I hope you did well on them. At least now the student council meetings can resume. Oh, sorry, all of a sudden I'm starting to feel nervous. 
All right, let's spend some time with Chihiro. How wonderful! Oh, happy to hear it. Um, in that case, would you like to come over to my house? It's a little far, but okay. This is the illustration collection I wanted. Remember? I do remember, but also a new room that we haven't been to before. Um, there's not really a lot to say here. She's got like a weird quilt on the wall, which is kind of all right. Lots of books, lots of uh, space for studying. Kind of neat and tidy. Okay, fair enough. There's not a lot I can psychoanalyze here. Uh, the books are organized, you know, roughly in terms of like, you know, it's the same color, which I assume is meant to mean same series. You could also probably see what they're called if you could actually read uh, Japanese, which I cannot. So i would be reading kanji, I think is the correct way of saying it, or probably not. Why am I trying to go further into this? Anyway, um, yes, illustration collection. Carry on. I bought all three. I blew my whole allowance, but it was definitely worth it. This book is by the same artist. If you're interested, you can borrow it. Just promise to think of me when you read it. Um, I don't read shoujo manga or thank you. Huh. She's invited us to her room and she's given us a gift. Do we say that we don't read it or thank you? Hmm. Uh, thank you. Oh, no, no problem. That was a difficult uh, social uh, situation to figure out there. I've read it so many times that I've practically got it memorized. Shoujo manga. It's getting dark out. Wait, my mom called earlier. Hey, she's got illustrations on the on the uh, cork board. Okay, a little bit more about her there. She said she has to stay late at work. Oh. And I, I've heard that there have been assaults on women in this area recently. Also, a lot of rabbits in the room, I've just noticed. Uh, I really don't want to be alone. Please stay. Just one more hour? I, I don't have to spell it out, do I? Hmm. Um, lock your doors? <laughs> Come on! I was just using that story as an excuse. I want you to stay! Or, to be more specific, I don't want you to go back to your dorm. There are so many attractive girls there, like the student council president. I know you have to go back eventually, but... Could we be here, together, for just a little longer? I want you to stay. I just need to know that you only have eyes for me. Chihiro has expressed her love for me. I am thou. Thou art I. The bond thou hast nurtured hath finally matured. The innermost power of the Justice Arcana hath been set free. We now bestow upon thee. The, the ultimate, ultimate form, form of the justice, justice within, within thyself. thyself. Rank up. We are now rank, max rank in the justice social link. Also, all of the uh, things have changed to hearts. Okay. The justice social link has reached its maximum level. You can now fuse Melchizedek. The Hand of Justice. Oh, Santa feels so warm being near you. I think I cut her off there. Oh, Senpai. I spent a long time with Chihiro. Good evening. I'm pleased to see that you're well. <sighs> Your pills. <sighs> I noticed once again that a new ally has been added to the ranks. Well, I suppose it's more of a pill.
pet than an ally. Makes no difference to me. It seems what you told us of their intentions is true. How terribly lamentable. Now we have no choice but to intervene. <sighs> it is up to the individual how to use the strength they are granted. But to erase the Dark Hour would be denying the very power they possess. And that is the one thing we cannot permit. Fine. Do whatever you want. Hold up a sec. What's your role in all this? We know they asked you to come back. You know, you're really starting to piss me off, nosy little shit. Yeah? Well, they're going down. You hear me? Hmm. Sorry, I, I know we're interrupting this, but on the... I, we've finally got a view of the right arm. I think we've seen that symbol before. It's the, um... It's the snake being pierced by a, um... Like a staff? Yeah, I'm sure I've seen that symbol before. Interesting. Anyway, moving on. And if you're on their side, and you're going down too, got that? I already told you, I'm done with them. Hello. Um. My name is Ken Kenamada. I'll be staying here for a while. I'll try not to be a bother, so please don't mind me. Ken is here. Okay. Um, the wait is over. The wild duck bird. Okay. Right. TV. Next up, news from overseas. A recent fashion show in Milan had an unusual theme. Life in space. Those attending watched supermodels wear space suits down the runway and ate delicious space food. Wait a second, I just had a thought. This... Is 729. Are we not um, busy on 729? We are. Maybe we get our evenings. Yeah, maybe we get evenings. Because I was just looking at that there thinking, wait a second, how can I do this on 729? We're busy. But anyway, uh, let's speak to everybody. I guess. Hello there. Data regarding the newest resident, Ken Amadasan, has been logged. I'm able to communicate with him at any time. Please leave it to me. I think Amarakun would get upset if he heard me say this, but don't you think he's kind of adorable? Not really. Oh. oh, maybe I'm getting ahead of myself. It's just the thought of having a little brother made me really happy. Oh, right. He'll be staying at the dorm, but remember, he's not a member of C's, so be very careful what you say around him. And don't talk with him about anything regarding shadows. Not bad. Just one little kid stuck living with a bunch of high schoolers. Well, I suppose it's not the worst thing to happen. Zappala, try and make an effort to be nice to the kid. Okay. It does seem a little odd to have somebody here, living here, who doesn't know about the secret. That seems just like an odd thing to have. Anyway, hello Ken. Oh! Oh, hello Zappala-san. Please allow me to reintroduce myself. My name is Ken Amada. That's Ken, written with the character for Dry. I just moved into the dorm. I'll be staying here for the summer. Okay, I suppose it's only the summer, so I guess it's not meant to be full time. Uh... I'm mad, uh, huh? And he's still in elementary school. Man, that's young. I don't know what it is about that kid, but my Junpei senses are going crazy around him. Mm. Either he's a little punk or he's way more mature than I am. I don't know, man. Is it just me? Hey! Hey, don't you think Amadakun is going to end up getting involved? You don't think a Madakun is going to end up getting involved in all this, do you? It's possible. Yeah. I guess you're right. Ikutsuki-san did say that he has potential. Okay. Uh, everyone's down here, right? Uh, yes, which means that there is nothing to do in the dorm today, so... Town map. Um... I guess we're going to go and... Eat the academics meal again. Again, again, again. Just constantly eating the same academics meal every day. Okay. Wait, can we do that today? Fridays! Yes. Wonderful. Wait. It's Saturday. Oh. 
Well, that's a problem. Okay, not now then. So we'll leave that be. Let's leave here. Head to Polonia and have a look and see what we can do here. Um, we can go to the arcade and do whatever that's got. So arcade, you're the answer. Raises academics. All right, that's kind of what we want to do anyway, so that works. Uh, speed through it, and we're still at level four. Okay, cool. And now it's Sunday. Summer vacation begins today. Okay, there are a couple things we want to do. First of all, Tanaka. Home shopping show. Let's go. It's amazing commodities. Okay, what have we got this I'm time? Going to do it. Part two of the designer brand set. It was so popular the first time around that we brought it back. Better than ever. Good, first good. up, we have the brand wallet. Not only is it stylish, it makes the perfect gift. Oh my goodness, it's wonderful. But wait, there's more. We'll throw in this perfume too, and guess how many? One. All of this for just 6,980 yen. Oh, okay. Well, obviously we're gonna buy it. We're obsessed, so. Cool. Thanks, kid. Next time we'll be introducing an assorted summer drink set. Don't miss it. B -b okay. Cool. Next up, do a quick uh, go through those. Now we're going to head downstairs, have a look at that TV, see if anyone has anything to say. And then we're going to spend time with Maya. Hello, Ken. Um. I guess Santa's a robot, right? What, you figured it out? You really can't tell whenever she wears normal clothes like we do. The Kirijo group must be super powerful to have invented a robot like her. Okay, well, there goes our uh, don't tell them about anything. On the next episode of Phoenix Ranger Featherman R, episode 23, here comes a new challenger. Ninja Locust arrives! And before the news begins, Feather Condor has a message for you all. Hey guys, there are some grim looking folks out there. But you viewers are okay, right? After all, you've got me looking out for you, so don't worry, we'll meet again next week. On today's news. Okay. Interesting one there about the weird folks. Um, okay. Yeah, it, it is oddly placed. That's cool. Right. I'm gonna uh, play it with Maya. Let's do that. Let's play the Immorpica. Let's go. I'm in Shinagawa Dungeon. Maya's not logged in. I'm running a little late. I'll be RT. K? Hmm? Maya entered the area. I was on to phone with my mum. With, with my mum. Huh. Whenever we talk, it's always the same. It's like she all she cares about is marrying me off to some dude. Ugh. Why is it her problem? Um... Okay, what were you going to say? You don't want to get married, you'll need a boyfriend first, let's plan our wedding then. She would like us to say, let's plan our wedding then. Even without meeting me IRL? Ooh, take me, Tetsuo. Maya seems happy. Don't worry, I still got it even at my age, lol. It's sexist to think women can only be happy when they're tied down. Ugh. The other night, I got a little drunky and kind of passed out at Polonia. And then this old dude was like, you'll never get a man looking like that. Ugh. I told him to shut the fuck up. Damn it. OTL. Sorry. Kind of got off topic. I guess I'm a little tired. But I do feel better now, XD. Here, Tatsua. This is for you. Maya used a heal potion on Tatsuo, but there was no effect. Oh, I guess your HP was already full. Lamalnade? Huh. I'm trying to say thanks for listening to all my bitchin'. I think Maya is opening up to me. I feel like we're growing closer. So, we got a rank up, and that gets us to rank 4. 
But she told us about a weird old guy who hangs around uh, at Polonia at night. That's just useful information for us. You know that lamer I told you about? He was hanging around Polonia, so... Uh, if you see him, don't be nice. I saw him on this weird TV show too. Super creepy. Alright, I better go practice being a good housewife for Tatsuwa. Hmm? Maya's player signed off. I learned about a man from TV who visits Polonia Mall at night. I decided to log out as well. And now it's the evening. Oh, hello. Get any studying done? Come to think of it, have you heard about B Blue V? It's the shop in Polonia Mall, but there's a rumor you can talk to spirits there. Sounds a little sketchy, huh? I wonder what kind of shop it is. Okay. The wait is over. Limited uh, set meal. I'm on the second floor. Oh, if you'd like to go to Tartarus, look for me there. I was wondering why she was telling me where she was. TV? Yeah. Okay, we've already done that today. That's fine. Oh, hello, everybody. Uh, ooh. You do want to spend time with Mitsuru, but I also want to go to Polonia. I think I can go to Polonia and come back, though. Hello. I have a theory. I've conducted a simulation to predict the outcome. First of all, the lost are a strain on society, since they drain resources but are unable to contribute anything. These individuals will also require caretakers, increasing strain on the workforce in other areas of society. I speculate. With fewer and fewer people working, society's growth will plummet. Eventually, the country will no longer be able to sustain itself. The end, as people say. Oh, lovely. I also just realized there's no reason to rush to go to um, see him because there's no timer on the quest. Uh, yes, no timer, so we're fine. Okay. Hello. Wait, seriously? Damn, I never thought of that. If it happens, how will I shop at the convenience store? Hey, listen. I guess the concept is too big for your brain to comprehend. You're an idiot, you know that? Yeah. The country made up is made up of its people. So if the number of the lost keeps growing, then the whole country will eventually collapse. Ah, oh, there's so much riding on our shoulders. I'm sure that there's no kind of metaphor being done here. Definitely not referring to any kind of real life concepts. Um if this country falls apart, what will happen then? Would a war or something break out? I probably shouldn't think too hard on this. I mean, we're fighting to prevent that from happening. Hello. Mm -hmm. Oh, would you like to read a book too? Then shall we read together? You could choose a book from here if you want. There are a couple biographies I recommend. What do you think? Sure, let's read. In that case... Alright, I'll go grab that book for you. Do you ever feel encouraged reading about the influential figures of the past? Even leaders who forged great nations faced the challenges of interpersonal relationships. Hmm. Uh, something on your mind? Well, it's natural to consider things, isn't it? Oh, were you expressing concern for me? Thank you. Sorry, I didn't mean to distract from our reading. Shall we get back to it? Oh, look at the time. I think that's enough for today. That was a pleasant time together, hearing nothing but the sound of each other's pages. By learning about the exploits of renowned individuals, my academics have improved. Okay. I'd like to hear your thoughts on our reading again sometime. But for now, good night. Fair enough. And now, it's Monday. The special training for track and field begins today. It's about time to leave. Yep, it's summer vacation and we're going back to the school. Wonderful. Gecko Can High School practice field. You know what's weird about this? In FES, this didn't feel like an odd part of the game, necessarily, because we had been spending so much time with Kaz and uh, Yuko. Um, but, because we haven't spent any time with them pretty much in this playthrough, this is just a very odd thing, right? 
I wonder what would happen, actually. You don't have to sign up for the club, do you? Hmm, maybe you do. I was thinking it encourages you to, but is there anything that actually forces you to sign up? If you don't sign up, do you have to do this? Huh. That's an interesting thought. I don't know. We trained all day to prepare for the competition on August 2nd. Hey, no slacking! Put your heart into it! It might be one of these ones where it forces you to do it. Like, it makes it seem like you could choose not to do it. But at the end of the day, it'll be like, hmm, maybe I should do this instead. And then it turns you around from whatever else you were trying to do. You'll never beat high, you say, with that attitude. Okay. It's now the evening. Welcome back. What's up, dude? Oh, that's right. Didn't you have club today? How'd it go? Pour me out. Wait, seriously? Well, don't push yourself too hard, dude. Hey, if you think you can handle it, let's go to Tartarus tonight. It's a little less than two weeks till the full moon, so I kind of want to hit the bullpen. Okay. Um. So we get our evenings. That's good to know. Hi, I'm Trish with today's installment of Who's Who. Today's subject is Trish's type of guy. He's smoking hot and still in his 20s. It seems he wants to be a policeman just like his brother. Next is the news. Pain, pain, go away. Nobody else wants to speak? Maybe you? Hello? By the way. I wonder if the next shadow will be even stronger. Maybe they'll be drained and weak because of the summer heat. Nah, not happening. Okay, there's no reason to hang out with Mitsuru because we've already got the maxing on her uh, cooking, so... As we're spending time with Igis. Um... Is it correct that you tend to the planters on the rooftop, Alpaxan? I am interested in attempting horticultural activities as well. If such a task is within your purview of operations for the day, would it be acceptable for me to join? Sure. I am both prepared and motivated to undertake this action. Shall we commence gardening? Let's go. Yes. Understood, I will be making my way to the rooftop with maximum efficiency. A very puzzling. As an odd uh, stance for going, uh, leaning down at the planters. The plants seem much livelier than they did when we started. Do you suppose they're happy that you are tending to them? Hmm. Um, I think so. Fascinating. There's no data on this, but it seems like you understand them. Hello, plants. I will be tending to you as well this time. Don't worry, I'll make sure to decrease my pressure output. But if anything starts hurting, just raise your left hand. Or rather, your left leaf. I had some prior knowledge of plants, but this was my first time observing them directly. These little seeds and buds in the earth can morph and change so quickly. Is this proof that they are living as well? How fascinating. I would like to watch these plants grow and document this experience for my records. I will tend to them with my full power. Cool. I tended the plants with Igis. This took more time than I'd anticipated. I will need to run more simulations to ensure there are no delays next time. Thanks to the care we put in, it looks like this will be a big harvest. It's gotten late. We should head back now. Okay. Cool. I, I do like these little extra conversations. They're, uh, they're neat. One thing that I think, I don't know if I already mentioned this on a previous episode, but um, I read a review before the game came out which said that these um, extra bits were really cool, but they did kind of detract from the um, the older parts of the game that had been brought forward. Like, a lot of the new dialogue is written in kind of a newer style, it's giving you more info on the characters, and it's um, of a quite a high quality. And then some of the old dialogue just doesn't hold up as well, which I think was an interesting take. Um, I, I kind of feel it for the beach part that we were at, I was like, the old part of the game just felt like it was lacking something that the newer parts of the game have, right? Like, the newer parts of the game feel like they're just a little bit more fleshed out, 
And I think that it doesn't stand out as much in FES because the whole game is kind of at that level. Yeah, it's interesting. Hmm. Anyway, the special training for track and field continues today too. It's about time to leave. Gekokan High School practice field. We trained all day to prepare for the competition on August 2nd. My body feels light, but my time wasn't that good. Well, oh. alright then, we'll need to try harder. There's a box on the counter. It looks like the product I ordered through the shopping program on TV has arrived. Let's see what's inside. It's the brand wallet and perfume. I mean, we already knew what it was, because we ordered it. Oh, it's you. Welcome back. Apathy syndrome is on the rise again. People seem to have calmed down a bit, despite the media, but there will be serious problems if we don't end this. We must defeat the last six shadows, beginning with the one we anticipate on the next full moon. If the number of the lost continues to increase, the city will fall into chaos. Huh? You're just exaggerating, right? Then again, maybe not. Come to think of it, the crops I planted on the rooftop should be ready to harvest by now. Alright. Uh, rooftop? Let's get them. Wonderful. Ooh, we got nutritious, refreshing, and nourishing, um, Amaron... Amaronians. Uh, let's plant some more, yeah. Let's do that. 8-7 for these ones. Okay. Uh, let's have a look at, uh, what we got. Oh, we also got the Imperial Sweet Sets previously. Instant Curry we got previously. Zelo Mist. Fresh Juice. I forgot we also got these um, incenses for increasing uh, power, but we'll uh, worry about them when we go into Tartarus. And then the other stuff is down here. So, Grown of Junpei cures distress, confuse, charm, rage, and fear for one ally. Oh, it specifically says who it's grown with. So I suppose if you maybe it's if you do it with somebody, then you'll get their bonus. So that's grown solo, so we get this one. And then grown of I guess cures an ally's free shock, poison, and down. It does. Okay. Cures all ailments beside KO for one ally. Oh, nice. Okay. Interesting. So if you were specifically looking for um like specific buffs, you might want to grow them with different people. And I suppose that means that if you grow different food with different people, you're gonna get different buffs on a different food. Okay, there's a little bit to that system. Hello. <sighs> we've been very busy this month. As a result, I'm not sure that we've been going to Tartarus often enough. Please make sure you're prepared for the next full moon. Hey, uh, I'm in charge. I'll get us to Tartarus enough. There's nothing interesting on the news. Oh, okay then. No, that's, uh... I'm not saying it's bad or anything, but when you've got a little kid staring at you, it can be kinda awkward. Um... Sanada-san, you always wear those gloves when you fight, right? I hear that. Once you put them on, you're undefeatable. Yeah. Yeah. It's no big deal, really. Okay. Um... 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 You know the incident that occurred because of the Kirijo Group's experiments? They said it happened because they were trying to collect shadows. Doesn't that mean shadows existed before Tartarus and the Dark Hour ever appeared? Interesting. How long have shadows been around then? Well, you, you'll need to play one of the other games. Wait, seriously? A city in chaos, huh? Sounds like something out of a movie. Ah, but that's... Um, but what's real scary is that it can totally happen, and we're the only ones who can do anything about it. If I may speak... I will fight with guns during battle. However, I am not heavily equipped and my damage output and accuracy are both average. On the flip side, I could say I am quite stable. I would be a good recommendation for beginners. Okay. Literally the game just saying if you want an easy path in combat, use Igus. Alright. Cool. Why am I going in here and looking at Yukari? Uh, the reason is, I just want to check whether we already have a personality increase. We don't. Okay. So, we want to hang out with her because this will be our third TV with her. Which will then get us the, um, characteristic. Hey! This is it! I borrowed the last volume of the series you and I have been watching. 
It's been a wild ride, and while I'm sad the story's ending, I can't wait to watch how they wrap things up. Okay, let's do it. Well, Zaplacoon, you ready for the finale? Let's do this. Yes! All right then, let's get into it. We're finally at the last episode. I wonder how it's going to end. You know, about this series, I mentioned before how it caught my attention, but I was afraid it might be too scary for me. But I'm glad I watched it. Guess it's important to break out of your comfort zone sometimes. Do you ever try watching things from genres you don't normally get into? Um, bring it on. Yeah, sometimes. Oh, wow. <laughs> I could learn a thing or two from you. Trying out all kinds of shows seems like a good way to find hidden gems. Watching this together made me realize how much I appreciated the main character. Like how she can't turn a blind eye to people in need and extends her hand to almost anyone. And of course the way she kept pressing forward no matter what happened. It was so inspiring. Come to think of it, isn't she just like you? <laughs> that might be a stretch. Remember how I told you about that girl I was close to who started ignoring me one day? It's not like I did anything to make her hate me. We'd been friends for a long time, but one day out of the blue, she just said, My mother told me I can't play with you anymore. It's because there were rumors floating around about my parents. I kind of get it now, looking back, but at the time, I was just sad. What I'm trying to say is, this show made me realize I'd like to be a little more like the main character. I want to be the kind of person who'd help anyone at any time. Someone who's kind and strong. It might be silly to say I look up to a fictional character, but there's no harm in following her example. At least, that's what I think. Hmm. Okay, interesting. Um, previously, I don't think it was mentioned that uh, other people kind of knew about her parents and about the fact, I'm assuming about the fact that one of her parents could have been involved in the um, incident or that, um, yeah, or maybe it was just that her parents were having troubles, but I think it must have been the, the incident in particular. Huh, interesting. So that gives it another perspective on uh, Yukari here. Okay, cool. She's been inspired by the protagonist of the show we were we watched on DVD. Healing Master reduces the SP cost of recovery skills to 50% of their normal SP cost. That's incredible. That's actually insanely good. Okay. Oh, the last episode's starting. I hope they'll make a sequel. By observing the main character, I've begun to understand the charm of an adult. Okay. I'll bring more DVDs I'm curious about next time. Oh, it's about time we head back to our rooms. Have a good night, okay? I've also realized something else. You know to hang out with Yukari, Fuka, and Mitsuru to get their social links, you need to get the social stat up to max. Well, they give you the social stat that, um, like, gets it to max rank, right? Or they, they give you the social stat that they need to get to max rank. So Mitsuru gives you academics, Yukari gives you charm, Fuka gives you uh, courage, right? So, in a way, what they've done here is they've, uh, for the romance uh, social links, They've effectively created a system where you're more likely to hang out with them before you then hang out with them for the social link, because you're hanging out with them for the social stat than for the link. That's kind of cool that you get to know the characters better before it jumps you into that. That's kind of cool. Okay. That's a uh, neat way of doing it. Okay. And now... We're going back to the training ground. It's about time to leave. Practice field, we all trained to prepare for the competition on August 2nd. You're almost there! Keep up the pace! This is our year! Highest day has got nothing on us! And... 
it's the evening. Welcome back. Hi, how was your day? The others aren't back yet. Kirijo Senpai said they'd be here by midnight. Maybe we shouldn't go to Tartarus today. Okay, well, I think I'm going to end the episode there. Thank you very much for watching. I'll see you next time. Goodbye.